In today's video, we're opening Vintage Yu-Gi-Oh's Mystery Pack Bundle. What's up guys, we're back with another mystery pack opening. My friend Vintage Yukio has created some mystery packs. So normally we're the ones creating the mystery pack, so I don't get to open the other mystery pack. I'm gonna open my own, but it's more fun when you don't know what's coming. So let's see what you can potentially get from some of these mystery bundles. You have a guaranteed eight. 2021 to 2023 first edition booster packs and a possibility of one extra mystery pack with odds below. Before we go farther into it, I do have a giveaway. I'll be giving away this promo pack from the 25th anniversary. There is a 25th anniversary secret rare in the back of this. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know what you think about this mystery pack bundle and is it worth it? Why haven't you done it yet? What are you talking about, Ruxin? What haven't I done? You haven't clicked my link down below for 15 free dollars on whatnot. Why would you want to do that? Because my whatnot streams have been insane. We've given away a ghost rare Stardust, a ghost rare Black Rose, and this next stream we're giving away a secret rare Dark Magician Girl. And you might still be asking, what is whatnot? Whatnot is a live streaming app where you can buy and sell things live, whether it be trading cards, shoes, or other collectibles. And not only that, they have a marketplace feature where you can sell things while you're not live as well. I've personally sold hundreds of items on the app in the last three streams, and my next stream is coming up May 11th at 4.30 p.m. Central. As I've already mentioned, the giveaways have been insane. We've given away almost $3,000 worth of cards, and I'm constantly bringing epic packs and singles for you guys to purchase as well. So if you guys don't want to miss the fun, make sure to use my link down below because you're going to get $15 for free on your first purchase on Whatnot, and I hope to see you guys there. All right, let's continue to see what else is in here. One in 100. So we have a one in 100 chance at a redeemable card for choice of various item worth $300 to $500. Full list of items will be provided to the winner. It sounds like a pretty nice uh, potential giveaway. One in 10, 2002 to 2006 first edition unscaled booster pack. So that's a lot of nice stuff there. And then one in five will have a first ed two chaos, two first ed uh, battles legend Armageddon or three times first ed legendary duelist seven packs. So let's see what we can get. I have seven of these mystery packs. So we've got like 56 packs to open today. Let's see what we can get. Hopefully we can get a one in 10. That'd be pretty cool. Um, one in a hundred. I'm not expecting to get that. That's pretty tough. So we have a green pack, which means we got, I'm assuming green is, yeah, green is the, the lowest one. All right. So we're going to have like the amount I paid here and then then uh, we're going to see if we can make our money back. Obviously, opening packs and trying to make money back out of a mystery pack is almost impossible. But our goal is to make it happen. So let's see if we can pull like a ghost share here. No, not that time. So what else did we get? Okay, let's just go one at a time. So we have a King's Court here. That's pretty nice. First edition. We could get a nice collector rare lightning storm in here. That could be pretty nice. Let's see if we can do a pot of duality, aka pot of awesome. Golden Eyes Idol. The Queen's Knight. Eternal Bond. We have the World Blast or the World, the Wicked Eraser. Where am I getting World from? And Thunder Speed Summon. That's just a super rare all right what else are we gonna get we have dimension force i think these are around the same price as ours you do get an extra pack i think we had seven packs they have eight packs in here so that's not bad uh so far we had a legendary duelist which is uh you know those are the lower value ones they're usually not too great omega judgment we have Preta plant i think we we would usually put like one to zero of those sometimes we put one in there we have a navy dragon mech um battles of chaos this is a really nice one this is a very good pack pretty epic to get battles of chaos i'm never complaining to open this set it's very nice for collecting and stuff ghost Trick festival mighty new we have smile potion the epsilon darton leaf place palace we have the sonic and libromancer agent so we are super in it up right now power of the elements this is a good set as well so a couple of good uh 2022 sets coming in here hopefully we can pull a starlight rare real quick let's make it happen we have nemesis rika sprite game of verse the life extreme morphtronic scanning gungan ship and a secret rare draco utopian aura i forgot about this card completely um hopefully that's over a dollar but i have no idea to be honest all right so now we have legendary duels duels from the deep these are not awesome but they do have forbidden drop of potential and of course the ghost rare so three legendary duelist packs that kind of makes sense how uh he's able to do the eight or nine packs for the price then if there's a bunch of legendary duelists yeah, there's three legendary duelists so that means four of the eight were legendary duelist packs so kind of makes sense i think we did six plus the bonus so this is eight plus the bonus and when the four of them are legendary duelists, it kind of adds up because they usually bundle these like two into one blister. So it's kind of equal to one pack. So that makes sense. Let's see if we can pull that Forbidden Droplet or that Ghost Rare. We have Marincess, Coral and Enemy, Quick Chaos, Marincess, and the Rage of Karyushin. Okay, so we got a secret rare out of the eight packs. That's not that bad. We have a green pack here. I'm hoping for Battles of Legend Armageddon or, of course, Tune Chaos. Those would both be pretty good. We have two Tune Chaos. So they first add. They are first add. That's pretty nice, actually. Yeah, double Tune Chaos is pretty big value. What's Legendary Duelist 7? Three packs of Legendary Duelist 7. What is that? 
that's the other option i don't know what that is okay pretty cool keeper dragon magic we'll take that gear breed did we get something here we have eternal chaos no we didn't we got a super rare stardust dragon oh yeah because toon chaos you actually could do the pack trick because this is before they started doing the weird thing where they put it as the third or the fifth card so i think we can do three from the back here we have desires good card that might add some money back it might be a dollar saying again which uh, we got the soldier, Gemini. Oh, it's the worst ultra rare. The Chaos Daedalus. We're super lucky because one and eight for an ultra, but of course, it's the Chaos Daedalus. All right, that was a pretty nice one. Let's go to mystery pack number two. I think they all just fell down next to me, so I uh, might have some on the floor right now. <laughs> Hopefully, we didn't damage anything. Okay, oh, did we get a silver pack? Silver pack. That means it's a 2002 to 2006 pack. Very nice. I kind of forgot that was what we were doing here. I was just like, yeah, it'll be the same thing as last time. All right, Silver Pack. It seems like, okay, Abyss Rising. We're going to start with those. We've got a Ghost from the Past. Okay, pretty good stuff. Let's put the all the, the Legendary Duelists at the front. All right, hopefully with all these Legendary Duelists, we can at least get some pulls, right? You know, we can get something. I think we have a lot of packs here, so we're not going to go... Wait, do we have a foil in there? Oh, yeah, it's not guaranteed. Legendary Duelist. Led Duelist, come on. Give us some good. Rank up Magic, 7... What is happening with that card? Look at this. There's like some sort of misprint on it where it's like got something that's weird that's a weird rare okay i'm gonna put that aside because that's interesting all right legendary duelist duels from the deep all right what will lewis send us vintage Yu-Gi-Oh. i bought some of these from vintage Yu-Gi-Oh. you can check them out i i guess on his instagram and his ebay i think i i think i saw him on his ebay and i just sent him a dm on instagram and you can get them that way as well um and then you save on like taxes and stuff like that if you have to pay taxes on ebay if you don't have your resale thing or whatever okay battles of chaos let's go here we go one two three four we have agent destruction monster rebirth ice jade dynamorphia we have sword soul strife dynamorphia sonic Eurodora, fate clear new world never mentioned soldier i'm i have faith for those they're just not happening yet king's court a lot of good cards i mean those god cards secret pharaoh's rare let's make it happen i'm not gonna do a pack trick for these because i don't know where it is zw reinforcements lightning storm would be pretty great come on we have a magnet induction okay no no lightning storm okay that's fine two more packs then we've got our silver pack what could we have gotten in a, we get a first dead pack of some kind that's pretty exciting oh wait this is a tactical master as well let's not do anything hey tama oh moon okay yeah this one is when they started doing the weird pack tricks ghost of the past second haunting ghost rare gotta believe it can happen one two will we get that dark magician girl we have dd necro slime vision hero ghost trick stein and a chronicle magician so we're not looking too good on our value here but this could change everything here we go this one's a smaller pack interesting okay let's see or wait is it a smaller pack maybe it's not actually no i was thinking of the other one. Oh, it is a power of the duelist naturally one of the sets that we somehow always have we now have more power of the duelist first edition i'm assuming this is hobby but i don't know hopefully this hobby but this does have some nice retail ulties we could pull either like either way this has a very solid lineup of ulties overall power of the duelist bless us one two three four give us that chimera tech over dragon you guys know rallis we have alien skull royal ritz sabersaurus viacroid destiny hero the rescue roid old bombardment and a supercharge so we're going rare in the day all right we didn't actually pull anything in that one even though it was a silver pack we didn't, i think we had a better first pack somehow uh by the way if you guys are not sitting back a popcorn now's the time because we got five more mystery packs so it's gonna be a little bit let's see actually let's let's do this a little bit more fun let's do this one at a time we have ghosts from the past yeah let's not reveal them all at the beginning i'm just, I'm just gonna go like this no pack trick right here let's just go for the ghost or a luber that's pretty good i think a luber is way down in terms of value but hey it's at least in a luber we'll take it we have a, oh a mavens pack this is nice magnificent mavens secret pharaoh rares a lot of good cards in here like harpy's feather duster that's really good a guido for the ashizu magician's restage cat shark and mizuki a lot of awesome cards in mavens it's just such a good set all right next one we have a king's court again so king's court has been pretty consistent it's not a bad set at all a lot of people like king's court we have a leo arms pendulum transfer arcane and joker eternal bond where you're returning alive and a triangle d holes who remembers the d holes now we go to a photon hypernova another good set a lot of quality new sets in here from vintage mr Yu-Gi-Oh. here we go we have ice jade basil trice sorry core meteor rush intimidating or chaos beast sneaky c it's sneaking around okay let's go to a dimension 
four. So let's go. Dimension Force Dipho. One, two, three, four. We have the Sunlit Sentinel, Musical Sumo, Supreme Sea Mare, the Branded Loss, Crow Tengu, Therion Stand Up, Divine Dragon, Scareclaw, and a Therion Cross. Okay, what else we got left here? We've got. Oh, yeah, I figured these were all duels from the deep. So let's pull all those out and then we can get our bonus pack. What will it be? Will it be a ghost rare uh, forbidden droplet out of here? We have Cyber Shark just as a common former secret rare from the duels Genesis. I know weird, weird rarity for that card. But yeah, it was a secret rare. We have the Frostosaurus. Also, that was an ultimate rare as well. Rare and an ultimate rare, but pretty interesting. Oh, yeah, one more. And then we have, I think, our last one, right? And then it's... Then it's the big boy. We have Frostosaurus again. And we're in this wave. I don't know where the foil would be. We haven't pulled a foil out of any of the duels from the deep yet. Unless maybe we got a super one time. I don't remember. Let's see what else. Lewis. Hey, Lewis. We got a misprint package here with nothing. <laughs> Hello. Hello. There is no misprint in me. That is not good. Well, there is a misprint. There's no package of mystery. This is not good. All right, Lewis. I'm coming for you. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, so um, yeah, I'm sure that 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 was not on purpose, obviously. So hopefully that is just this is the only one that happens, and you know, I'm sure we'll figure it out. All right, so we got a misprint package. Oh wait, this is not a misprint. The greens are not guaranteed. Oh, this is making more sense. I was like, how is he putting in a green every time with double tune chaos? So only sometimes you get the mystery pack. Interesting. Oh, okay. So there's no guaranteed pack. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, we just happened to get two in a row somehow. We got a one in five and a one in 10 right off the bat. That makes more sense. Okay, yep, I did, I read those wrong. Galaxy Soldier, it's a nice card. That was my mistake, whoops. I was like, uh, <laughs> okay, whatever. Just keep going, Blazing Vortex. Um, I will say, uh, now I can feel in there and we, we got one this time. So we got another one, which is good. I mean, that's not a bad thing at all. We have a Fabled, we have Fabled Trees. And why does it feel like there's a lot of cards in this one? Spring, it's, that's why there's eight, because you're not, because the eighth is, okay, makes sense. Seal Star. So sometimes you get a whole extra one. Very interesting. Battles of Chaos, Last Chance. Not Last Chance, but another chance, I should say. One, two, three, four. Monster Rebirth, The Shining, Top Share, Ogdoidic, Ghost Trick, Skilled brown doll of happiness neroy and dictator of d hey that's a card for the blue eyes deck it's pretty good actually all right anything else what do we got we have a maze of memories okay gay guardian collector rare will we make our money back because right now i think we've made like two bucks back no probably a little bit more than that i think dictator of d is actually one dollar so he might be Okay, that's not gonna add anything, but Gay Guardian, we like it. So the first one where I didn't like reveal it till the end, I somehow didn't, uh, you know, it was the first one without a without a pull or whatever. We have the Silent Angler, Marincess. Where are the where are the foils in here? If you pull one, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know where they would be. Ghosts from the Past Two. Is that two Ghosts from the Past Two in this package? Not bad. Everybody likes Ghosts from the Past. They're always fun. We have Vampire Takeover, the Fossil Fusion, the Doppel Warrior, Geomathic Final Sigma. And a fossil machine skull convoy. All right, come on, give us some, give us something. Yeah, yeah, ghost chair or forbidden droplet. Let's pull that silent honor arc. We have Marincess. Set. Oh, do we get something? Levia, it moved. Oh no, he didn't. The rare just moved spots for some reason. I had hope for a second. Okay, duels from the deep. Duels from the deep has been killing us. I think we've opened like a half a box and we haven't pulled anything. In terms of number of packs, we have Marincess, Full Armor. Yes, Ultra Rare Marincess Aqua Argonaut. I don't think it's a crazy card, but hey, we pulled something out of Duels from the Deep. We'll take that. Okay, is there any more packs? There might be one more in there. I can't tell. Oh, another silver. What in the world? All right, that yeah, we're lucky now. One in ten, but we got two. So uh, yeah, haters will say it's uh, say it's rigged, but yeah. Okay, let's just see what we get. <laughs> let's see what we get. Oh, Pharaonic Guardian. So it's all our sets that we open all the time. It's Pharaonic Guardian and Fair. I mean, not Fair Servant. That would have been nice. Pharaonic Guardian and Power of the Duelist. This is still a nice set, though, because, of course, Maiden of the Aqua, Power of the Duelist. Um, no, what am I talking about? Maiden of the Aqua, uh, Metamorphosis. What's the other one? There's one more. Uh, Trap Dust Shoot. Yeah, there we go. 
Swarm of Locusts, let's go. Cry you out. I should have done four from the back. Buster Rancher, Poison Mummy, Call of the Mummy, Dark Designator. Yeah, Charm of Shopti. Ah, oh, ah, oh, two old packs, but two whiffs. That's just how it goes, guys. All right, three more mystery bundles. We've gotten really lucky. We've gotten two silvers. We can't really ask for anything else. I mean, that's how it goes. Sometimes you get lucky, but then you got to still pull something. That's just, that's part of it. We have a Tactical Masters. Is it really one in five for the greens? I mean, how are we pulling so many things? I don't know. I don't know how uh, he went about, uh, you know, mixing them up or whatever. So I don't know. Labyrinth set up. I feel like we're getting really lucky right now because uh, I feel another one in there. I mean, it, it might be the green. It's probably the green or it could be the gold. <laughs> yeah, gold. Hit me up. One, two, three, four. We have Majestic Absorption. I don't know how many he made, so I don't know how many golds there are out there, but uh, one in a hundred. That's pretty rough in terms, not rough, I should say, but tough. Yeah. Oh, Iris Sword Soul. Secret rare. Another secret rare out of Dawn of Majesty that used to be 25 bucks, but not anymore. Yeah, we did one in a hundred as well for the big time stuff. I mean, if you're going to get a $500 card, I'd be like, I think this was like 48 bucks or something. Yeah, it's got to be pretty rare. It can't be, can't be too low. So that makes sense. One, two, three, four. But when you do get it, it's some craziness. Like I mentioned this before, but a guy opened the Ruxin pack and he pulled a gold pack, which means there's a super rare. That is also a Starlight Rare in the set. He pulled a gold pack, which had a Air Neos Ultra Rare inside. Then he also got a Battles of Legend Armageddon pack that he then pulled the 10K Dragon in the same mystery pack. So, or maybe it was the same order. I don't remember what it was, but the dude went insane, like absolutely insane. So that's pretty it's like exciting that that can happen we have a super rare right there i think it was the same pack i'm pretty sure he got both out of the same pack all right legendary duel stools from the deep let us duel in the deep with ghost rares we have a marinza sea angel it should be the four slot if it was like last time and it wasn't this time we have a a couple little spoilers there we have a duel from the deep I want to get the Ghost Rare, one in 288. Come on, baby, we have Full Armored Lancer. We got a Super Rare, hey, Super Rare that's not guaranteed. I'm taking it, it's not bad. Oh, we got a double, we got a double. I pulled two out. We have Abyss, right, or Duels from the Deep, not Abyss Rising, that's a different set. And then Power of the Elements, which I almost pulled out last time as well. Oh, a Marincess Coral Triangle. So we're getting a lot of Marincess now. We're kind of hit, heating it up. The uh, not Abyss Rising, the Duels from the Deep. Pote, let's go. A lot of reprints on this set, but sprites are still pretty crazy. So I wouldn't be mad to pull some sprites. The ban list is probably going to be out by the time you guys see this, though. I mean, people have been waiting for it for weeks. Sprite Carry, that's a crazy card. We got Scannon. We got Venus Lift. We got Branded Ravenous and an Ian Wave. I remember pulling a misprint one of those in our large stream opening. Okay, anything else left in here? It's a gold. Okay, green pack, which is good. A lot of good stuff in the green pack. All right, Battles Legend Armageddon or Toon Chaos. That's what I want. It feels a little, oh, maybe it could be the Toon Chaos. It doesn't feel like three packs, but Legendary Duelist could be. Ooh, oh, it is two Battles Legend Armageddon. Ooh, this is nice. Yeah, two Battles of Legend Armageddon. Let's see, that guy pulled that 10K in the Ruxin pack. Now it's my turn to pull the 10K out of the Vintage Yu-Gi-Oh pack. Oh, the secret is right at the beginning. Okay, maybe not in this one. <laughs> I forgot that they did that. That was the worst. Okay, so you got it. Okay, at least it doesn't show it at the beginning. So you can go like that. We have Obedience, the Appliancer, Fire Flint, and a number 90, C92 Heart Earth Chaos Dragon. So no, no 10K. Two more mystery packs. We've had very good luck with getting, you know, some of the extra packs here. We've gotten two greens and two silvers and just five packs so far. So I'm expecting nothing out of these last two. I am expecting nothing, and I will probably be right. First of all, we will start off with an Amazing Defenders. We call it an Atrocious Defenders, but hey, this set has been going ham, guys. With all the new sets coming out, the support, Pearly's gone way up. Some of the other ones are doing better. It's it's not bad. Oh, we got something. Oh, it's damage! No! The water barbecue! That's what I was thinking it looks like. Oh, it's damage at the top. I remember this being really bad on this set, but hey, ultra rare. That's not bad. We're taking that all day. Okay, let's try this one. Dimension Force. Can we get a Starlight Rare and make our money back here? Let's do it. A Starlight Rare would be pretty close, right? I mean, I think it was like 300 and... I, I, you guys have seen what it started at, but I think it was like 350 or something like that. Slightly less than 350. Oh, Magnifica. That's a good Exo Sister card. I hate these from uh, Master Duel, but hey, pretty good card. That might actually be worth a little bit. We got oh, a double here. Oh, no, 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 no spoilers there. We have a Blazing Vortex. We're kind of going all over the place. Phantom Rage, you're going to get that Zeus Starlight real quick. One, two, three, four. Can we get that pot, baby? Starlight Rare Pot of Prosperity. Let's do it. Or just Secret Rare. Take that as well. Pendulum, we have. Knight of Armor, 
the Ancient Warrior, and the Virtual World Odahime. Phantom Rage, Zeus. We have indeed pulled the Zeus before. You guys have seen it. It was amazing. One, two, three, four. It was epic. We have Rookie for Hire, Free Range, Virtual World Gates, Paralysis, their Might and Cry, Man of the Match, Generator, Transverser. That card has been many, many people, including me in auction series. All right, Battles of Chaos. Yes, an epic, epic pack. One, two, three, four. We have S-Force, Lapswell, Dogmatica, Groza, Dynamorphia, Dynamorphia, Doll Monster, Dimension, Fire Opal Head, and the Magic Karibo. Let's go. Our old friend, Magic Karibo. That is very epic. You'll love to see that super rare. All right. Uh, okay, I don't think we got anything in this one based on... Uh based on this. I, I feel like it, I can't feel anything. So we might've gone over on this one, but we still have packs. So maybe we can pull something big. We have Scareclaw, Omega, War Rock, Heroic Challenger, Backup Team. That was a Ruxin special, right? To the super rare. No big deal. We got a couple more packs in here. Ghost from the past two. All right, we've got a Luber, another a Luber. That's two a Luber. That's pretty good, actually. All right, one more pack, maybe? Yeah, one more pack, and then we are done with this one. So, goes from the past two. Oh, I just fell on my foot. Oh, no. It's going to be messing with me the whole time. Two from the back. Ghost Rare, here it comes. We have Insector. We have Chimera Tech, Retaliating C, and a Sky Cavalry. All right, our final mystery pack from Vintage Yu-Gi-Oh! The Mystery Pack Bundle. So far, it's been pretty fun. I mean, it's, it's been an enjoyable experience. A lot of packs to open. We've had good luck getting the bonus pack so far. We'll see if we can get one more in this last pack. Let's start off with the Ghost from the Past, too. So we got two silvers. I mean, that is about as good as you're going to ask for right there. Now can we get a Ghost Rare? Let's go. Insector Gigamantis. Fossil Warrior Skull Might. Not too shabby. Let's see what else. Whoa! What is this? A bonus pack or card. Enjoy and tag me on Instagram. Let's go. Little spell ruler action. Very nice. Okay, so we got ourselves a bonus pack. It's a PSA sleeve. Interesting. This is a spell ruler. This is not first edition, but it is red banner logo. So we got old school. Let's save that one for the end. That might be our, our best pack of the thing. So let's go a 2022 that's not bad and get pot of prosperity we'll take that that's pretty good pretty cool i didn't know you could get bonus packs oh wait did i not read that uh, i need to uh read the rest of the pack we have all these pictures and i was not paying attention we have ghost mourner we have a super rare ultra and a ready fusion i thought it might have been the pot okay nothing in that one that's okay probably should have checked this a little closer so they have pictures of everything but Packs or repetition of what can receive. Okay, yeah, here's some of the stuff, those, those graded cards. So I don't think it says anything about the bonus pack. Yeah, I don't think it actually mentions that on the packaging at least, so that's still cool. Um, Power of the Elements, here we go. Is this first set or unlimited? Okay, first set. Because they did have an unlimited wave of Poe, which is pretty crazy. Sprite Red, that's nice. Uh, can we get a Sprite card? That'd be cool. Sprite Pixies, I don't think anybody uses that one. Crawler, Ravenous, Gadgets, and an Emperor, super rare. What else can we grab out of here? Ooh, Battles of Chaos. We got Magic Rebo, but we haven't gotten anything big like Dark Magician. So, hey, that could be cool. Dark Magician, Starlight Rare, uh, Blue Eyes Jet, Dark Magician, Starlight Rare. And there's a lot of good ones in here. Let's see what we can do. Skill Brown. Another Magic Karibo! These were made for me. This is insane. Double Magic Karibo. That's epic. All right, Double Magic Karibo. That's pretty sick. Now we have Dimension Force. Can we get a Starlight? I didn't really pull many Starlights out of this set, so there's a lot I need to pull for my searching for Starlight Rares. Symphonic Warriors, Predaplant, Scareclaw, Devouring, we got Vivid Sail, Battle Guard, Heroic Champion, Super. A couple packs left. Let's see. They're probably Duels from the Deep for some of them. Can we get that Ghost Rare? So you're basically guaranteed to get Duels from the Deep, it seems. Those are kind of an automatic inclusion. So Baryon. So if you're looking for that Forbidden Dropwood or that Ghost Rare, then, you know, you got to have some chances in here. So far for us, no luck, but hoping that it will turn around right here at the end. Seventh Eternity. See Stealth Attack. Okay, not this time. What do we have? One more pack? I think that's it. That's our last pack in there. Okay, one more Legendary Duelist, Duels from the Deep, and then a Spell Ruler bonus pack, which is pretty cool. I always love bonus packs, especially if they're Spell Ruler. 
Okay, nothing in those duels from the deep. We ended up getting a few foils out of there, which wasn't too bad. Our final pack, Spell Wilder. We're definitely not making our money back, but uh, it's not about when you open the packs. It's more about before you open the packs, if you made your, actually made your money. Because opening packs, you're almost guaranteed to lose money. So you, that can't be part of the mystery pack. One, two, three, four. Here we go. We have Mystic Plasma Zone. Cool. Whiptail Crow. Performance of Sword, Giant Sword who Feeds on Flames, Course of Sanctuary, Mechanical Snail, Slot Machine, His Little Brother, very nice, and an Amoeba. All right, so we got three old packs out of here, but we didn't pull anything out of those. This was still a lot of fun. Here's how much we lost. I think it was a lot. I don't think we pulled anything too crazy. We got a couple of Magic Rebos. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content like this. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Daxter, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto DeAnda, Dizzy, Hoppus, Choice 333, Michael James Jance, TCG Trust of Cards, America Deutzer, Supreme Sage 21 and then the Tai Show, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Mimic Gecko, and Thomas McLean. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.